Hey everyone, it's Melanie. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video for you is really exciting. I have a Mac PR box that I received kind of a long time ago. So I'm gonna open it up and show you what's inside, so stay tuned. Okay, so when I say this is a big box, it's a big box, so. Uh, this is a box. Um, it's got a lot of stuff inside, and so I opened it up for the first time maybe about a week ago and just discovered the colors inside. There's some crazy colors in here, so I'm gonna swatch them all for you, but first, uh, let me show you what is going on in here. All right, so here it is. This is the box inside. It came with this cute little card. It's the Lips, Lips, Lips box, and so um, this is actually removable here so it can live in the box or it doesn't have to if I don't want it to. Um, there are four trays here. So the first tray, there are 24 lipsticks. Second tray, there's 24 more lipsticks. Here we have liquid lipsticks. Um, they are called the Retro Matte Liquid Lip Color. And then some um, lip liners here. And then Right here we have lip glasses and a prep and prime. So a lot of cool stuff and I'm gonna swatch them for you right now. All right, so I'm excited to show you all these colors. I'm gonna start off by taking off my lipstick. So um, this actually, the shade I'm wearing is Hang Up by MAC and it's a creme sheen, cream sheen uh, formula. I like it because it's not drying like a matte would be and um, it's pretty low maintenance. People would probably laugh if they ever thought of me being a low maintenance person, but I can't keep up with a matte lip and the dry lips and reapplying and all of that. So um, this is just reapplying when I need to. <laughs> and it does actually last a really long time. So um, love this, love this formula a lot and this color. So let me get that off. So they still a little bit left, but I think we're good. Of course, of course, of course, of course, of course. Of course. Okay. Good. All right, perfect. So inside the box, there's a lot, a lot of colorful things. Um, I don't have a lip liner for each of these, but um, I will go ahead and get started. I'm gonna just take out the top drawer and put each one of these on. So first up is Retro Matte called All, All Fired Up. This is a very pink red color. It's very pink. <laughs> it's taking me so long. Okay. It's a nice pink. It's very um I don't know. It takes on the color. I would. I think I would want a lip liner under this because it takes on the color of my lips, and so my lips are two different colors. So. But it's cute. I like it. Next up, we have a matte called Antique Velvet. This is kind of a Bardot color. Um, actually, it looks really brown. So I'm gonna put that on. Ooh, that's nice. This is like 90s dream. It's a little over the bottom, whatever. And so what this looks like, so. I love this shade. I am really happy with this one. This one's good. This is a winner. Okay, up next, we have a frost formula, and this one is the color Bronze Shimmer. Beautiful gold, so I'm imagining this is really sheer when I put it on. Yeah, super sheer. That's cool. There's a little bit of the last color on still. I really like this one. I thought it would be a little crazy, but it looks good on me, I think. Next shade we have. Oh, this is a matte called Candy Yum Yum. This one's a classic. I think this one's a little bright for me. And I've tried it in the past, and I think it might be a little too insane. 
into plums and deep colors. This doesn't necessarily look bad on me, but it's out of my comfort zone for sure. I look crazy. Help. Help. Okay, next is a satin called Captive. So let's see what this is. Oh, this is nice. It's kind of a mauve, like a purpley pinkish mauveish color. Oh, this is really pretty. Okay. This one could maybe be a thing. Maybe. Okay, this is a frost and it is called CB96. That is orange. Okay, so hopefully it's share our colors. Oh, oh, oh. okay. All right. I really like these frost ones. I like this. Yes. Yeah. It's a yes. Here we've got a mat called Chili. I think this one's also kind of a classic. Yeah, it's kind of a brown red. And um, let's see. Oh, my lips are still a little wet from the solar water. I'd say it's our an orange red. Actually. I don't know if I would normally gravitate to a color like this, but I'm realizing maybe that's something I should do. I like it. Okay, next shade is a luster called Cockney. It's another red. This one seems like a pretty true red. Ooh, I like this formula. I just feel like mats are so committal, like, you just, oh gosh, I'm doing a terrible job taking this off. Um, yeah, you no, know, mats, you just gotta keep checking on them. Maybe that's just me, but I like stuff like this, because when it goes away, it just kind of goes away, leaves a little hint. I love, I love this one. This is nice. Okay, next we have a creme sheen called Creme Cup. Ooh, okay. This is gonna be risky on me. Let's see. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I, I won't do colors like this. This is so ashy on me. This is, this is a no. Sorry, y'all. Okay, here we have a mat called D for Danger. Looks like that. Dark red. Oh, actually pretty red. Pretty just red. This is a color my mom would wear. That's what it looks like. Yeah, I feel like my mom has colors like this, like this is her go-to or something. Here we have a creme sheen called Dare You. Another dark red. This one looks more um, on the warm side than the last one. Yeah. Feeling this. I like this one. This is a nice one. It wins. Okay, next up. This is one of my favorites. This is my first MAC lipstick, actually. It's a matte called Diva. And um, yeah, this was the very first lipstick I bought when I was in college. Sophomore year. I'm just thinking back, like, I know who I was with. It was a funny conversation. And it actually revolves around me having tried candy yum yum and hating it back then. So I think that says something.
Okay, good enough. And this is what this looks like. I love this color. It, it brings back memories. <laughs> okay, next up, this is a mat called Dream Pot. This is very turquoise. This is so like, like Robin's egg blue. Okay, wish me luck. Oh no, <laughs> crazy shades don't look great on me. Maybe it's just that I never went into this realm. This needs a lip liner for sure for me. Like, <laughs> Sorry. No. Oh God. Okay. Improvement. Okay. Um, Retro matte, this one is called Flat Out Fabulous. This could maybe work. This is pretty fuchsia. Okay. I'm surprised I like this, but I like this. I'm really feeling this. I'm really feeling this one. This one's a good one. Okay, this is a frost. I'm loving all the frost so far. This one's called Fresh Moroccan. This looks pretty brown. Brown shimmer. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh my gosh, I got lipstick everywhere. I have no more highlighter on my cupid's bow. I like this one. This is a good one. Another winner. Here we have um, a frost called gel. Oh, that's not the color I was expecting at all. This is a very like champagne color. I really like these um, these frost ones because I feel like I don't have to fight with the color of my lips. I, I like like having to wear. Um, I when it comes to like lipstick, I tend to wear lip liner underneath to get a solid color. But these, um, I just kind of like the something. I don't know. I like glosses a lot right now, so this kind of is reminiscent of that for me. Okay, next shade is an amplified lipstick called Girl About Town. So I have no idea what this formula is like at all. It's another hot pink. So let's see. Ooh. I love the formula. I like the color. I think it works on me. I don't think it's a perfect match, but I... I would wear it still. Okay, this is a matte and it's called Heroin. It is purple. That is like a nice purple. Ooh, it's super sheer. Is it? It's not supposed to be. I like this. I think this is gonna get me out of my comfort zone with color. I have about I don't know how many lipsticks I own aside from these, but they're all like the same color. So this is, I really like this one. My lips are starting to get unhappy from all the rubbing. Ugh. Ow. All right. This is a matte called Honey Love. Oh no, this is another bad one. It's the same color as me. Let's see. Oh no. It's lighter than me. 
I just don't feel like this is, this is not my look. This is not my look. Okay, here we have, ooh, another amplified lipstick. This one's called Impassioned. That's pretty, like that is hot pink. Like that is like fluorescent almost. Again, like the formula, don't love the color. It sent me another pink and a very, and like the same formula, very similar pink. Mm. I can't tell if my lips are stained or if they're just that unhappy with the amount of rubbing I'm doing. Okay. In my fashion, this is a matte. This is black. I'm feeling this. I, I, I have a black lipstick from Urban Decay that I love, so. I might wear this one tonight. I'm, I'm feeling this. Okay, next shade, this is a matte called Instigator. Very dark color, almost black, but it's purple. Yep. Yep. I'm smiling, you know I like this one. Matte, kind of sexy. Oh no, this is going to be another bad one. <laughs> Whenever I do that laugh, you should know. Nope. This is a white person color. All right, so next up we have a matte called Lady Danger and my lips, they're stained. They're also angry, but they're stained. Um, but this is a very orange color. So that's what it looks like. I'm feeling this one. I like oranges. I didn't know I liked oranges. <laughs> All right, hate to break it to you, but there's gonna have to be a part two. Um, my lips are a little too angry and there's still a lot of lip colors to go. So um, I'll do some more of this next week. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching. If you like what you saw, hit subscribe and I'll have more videos like this for you soon. So thanks for watching.